Legends TV. Signing number six is through the door in SE16 in a 23-24 season. Today, out of absolutely nowhere, Richard Kelly expects it will be done very soon. And it has just been done as I film this around 6pm on Thursday. Brooke Norton Cutty joins from Arsenal on a season-long loan. He is predominantly a right wing back. Very, very attacking apparently he's 19 years old and last season he spent the first half of the season on loan at Rotherham and the second half of the season on loan at Coventry where he played a part in pushing them towards the playoff final this in my opinion is a very very good signing championship experience 19 years old highly rated Londoner he was born in Pimlico actually born the year we got to the FA Cup final. <laughs> Jesus Christ, that makes me feel old and makes him look extremely young, which he is. It's a really, really good signing. It's a signing, in my opinion, that the fans, the team and Gary Rout really, really needed to give us a lift before going into Saturday's game against Stoke. Gary Rout's old club, which allegedly he is going to be, uh, Norton Cuffey I'm talking about, available to play in. Look, Gary Rowett said it himself. It's written all over his face. I've put a couple of maybe controversial videos out this week, but I've just been honest. I praise Rowett at times and I criticise him at times. He did say after the Norwich game, you know, on the back of that, I need to strengthen the group this week. And he's done exactly that. And you have to take your hat off to him. We need an injection of something. We look very, very imbalanced um, in these wing-back positions slash back four. I think this signing points towards now. He will pursue with five at the back and play wing-backs. Danny McNamara is an out-and-out right-back. He signed Joe Bryan to be a left wing-back, which is what Joe Bryan is, and at 29 years old, I think he is. I think he's not going to change in his career. We don't want him to change. We want him to get forward. But Danny McNamara isn't so good going forward, which give us, as I said, that little imbalance. I think with Norton Cuffey coming in, we are going to go, boom, wing-backs, and go for it. Look, I haven't got a problem with five at the back if... We've got the right players to do it. I think that definitely a centre-half needs to come in as well. I think the transfer window closes in a week's time. So we'll be interesting to see what develops there. And I think we probably will go after another centre-half. And I think it probably will be another young Premiership loanee. I don't know anything. That's just me reading between the lines. It now brings in a position where it looks like Danny McNamara could drop out of the side. Love Danny Mac, me all through and through. There was a time, of course... When Danny McNamara was, was much sought after, will he sign this new contract? Will he go to Queen's Park Rangers? Southampton are watching him, allegedly. Um, he's definitely lost his form. I think that's written all over his face and evident in his touch going forward. Still a brilliant defender, but look, I think it will help Danny Mac maybe to drop out the side for a bit, take the heat and the pressure off him. Uh, there's a lot of pressure on a lot of players at the minute, as well as the manager. So I think him dropping out you know, won't do him any harm at all. And it will bring back healthy competition. We've seen it for years at right back. Marlon Romeo um, and Sean Cummins. Marlon Romeo and Conor McLaughlin. And then you had, of course, Danny McNamara and Marlon Romeo. Danny McNamara and Jamie Shackleton. So I definitely think strength and depth is the way forward. And I think they could push each other to be in the form of their lives. We have, of course, also got Wes Harding. I'm not sure, you know, where his best position is. I've not seen him play. I've heard he can play anywhere along the back line. But he's predominantly a right wing back, so obviously he's not favoured. I'm not sure why he's at the club. I'm sure Gary Rowett does know. I'm not. I'm not having a pop at him about that. We just haven't seen him start a game yet, or even really figure in many. He came off the bench yes against Norwich. He didn't start in the Carabao Cup, so not sure what Harding's role is at the club. He's definitely not competition with Danny McNamara. That is for sure because it's been confirmed that Brooke Norton Cuffey has signed on a season-long loan from. Arsenal, he's been at the Gunners since 2015, he turned pro in 2021, he had loans last season at Rotherham and Coventry, and he's a highly rated, predominantly an attacking right wing back, will he go straight into the starting 11 this weekend, you'll have to watch my preview later on to find that one out, please subscribe to Lions TV, come on you Lions!